thank you sadguru ji uh, you gave me opportunity to have this uh, celebration of guru purnima utsav with this much big presence over here but a big question comes to my mind that we keep and especially the indians keep after the god and the parents guru at the highest esteem but we have not been able to make guru purnima celebration utsav in the same spirit of high spirit as we respect the gurus the reason why guru purnima and so many other things which were of great spiritual importance in this country have slid back into the background of our lives is because we have been an occupied nation for a period of time and whatever the framework that the occupying forces set for us when we got our independence we should have looked at what kind of framework we want for our nation we did not do that we just allowed the same framework to continue for example in this country right from ancient times even for a farmer who plows the land even today many farmers don't set their plow on their land on monday mornings yes in tamil nadu it's still true in the north it's been given up because no no animals being used all tractors you have to you have taken a bank loan the interest is ticking so you want it to run all the seven days <laughs> all these things When the British came, they changed these things because they they knew the strength of this nation was essentially in the culture. So they wanted to break the culture very systematically. They engineered how to break the culture. They made you Sunday holiday. What are you going to do on Sunday? Watch television and eat potato chips? What are you going to do on Sunday? They had an intention for a Sunday morning. what is the intention for the majority of the population in this country on sunday morning there's nothing for us to do on sunday morning monday morning there are lots of things happening but you have to go to office for a long time in this country the monthly holidays were like this purnami means every purnami means three days holiday one day before the day and the next day amavasya means two days holiday these these two days of full moon day and new moon day have something to do with our system something to do with the planet something to do with the very way we are born we are physically here today only because our mother's bodies were in sync with the cycles of the moon otherwise we wouldn't be here so there are things which are happening in your system as you know the very oceans are rising on these days when such a massive body of water is rising up this body which is over 70% water you think nothing is rising in this that the, those days were kept as spiritually significant days those are not the days to go to work those are the, the days to focus upon yourself So similarly the Guru Purnima used to be a huge festival across the this whole region but it's gone because people have to go to work so i request you being a, you being a minister in the union cabinet this is something that you must do <laughs> that i know for you to pitch for every purnima uh, purnami being a holiday is not going to be practical but at least guru purnima <laughs> if you from the central government if you declare guru, guru purnima as a holiday i will make sure guru purnima is celebrated across this country with great fervor <laughs> Mm. 
because… because the spirit is still alive, there is no space for expression. There is no space or time for expression. Please, if you can do this one thing, and we can make Guru Purnima a big attra a tourism attraction for this in country. <laughs> as… as I've already spoken to you about making spirit India the spiritual gateway, Guru Purnima can be the day which really draws spiritual tourists from across the world to this country. So even as a part of your job, it's a good thing to do. <laughs>